it's stuck here and today we are going to be having a tutorial on how to play project flight so once you're in this starting menu you want to go to click fly now free flight choose whatever plane you want but i normally go for a330 it'll come up with all these liveries here and you get to choose between which ones you like so i'm just going to go for Aer Lingus right now and I am going to go to London Gatwick. Now I'm at London Gatwick, I need to select a gate. We'll go for gate 203 because it's close to the runway for this tutorial. Once I'm here, I usually click on options, then I go to weather. Once I'm at weather, I adjust the time see it's kind of like orangey sunset here and then I go to my settings and turn off airport names and call signs so once I am at here now I like to turn my logo lights to three by clicking L three times then I select my route which I want to go to and we'll be going to Gran Canaria today. Once I've selected Gran Canaria, I zoom out on the little thing. And then, as you can see, the screen line will appear. And that's the route I will be following. I turn my engines on and I click P for pushback. And you can now see that I am going backwards. Once I'm about at this, once I'm about at this point, I start to I click A and I turn to the right. So I'm moving. You have to click A to get into um this mode where you can point your joystick, well not your joystick, your mouse thing, where you're going, and then you move. So once I'm here, I turn off push back and I click brake so now I'm braking and I go to 12% and I start taxiing. Sometimes it takes a while for the plane to get going but once it is getting going it's all fine. So as you can see my airspeed is going up a little bit so that means my knots that I'm going. So and then the 12% below it means how much percentage I'm using. Now that I am on the runway, I turn my flaps to TO, which is take off. Then I put my camera which onto seven, which is underneath, and I go to take off. As you can see, when you get to 100% you start gaining speed very quickly and basically when I like to get to 100 knots before I start going up so now I'm at 100 knots I'm going to slowly bring my landing gear upwards and this person is ruining my takeoff no worries though, I'm going to slowly bring my landing gear upwards and then I'm going to click G so the landing gear retracts. Now I'm upwards, I'm going to go up here and I'm going to climb till I'm about 3,000-2,500 knots. Altitude. Now we're at takeoff and we finished our takeoff. We are going to follow our direction. So the direction I'm going is towards Grand Canaria. And if you can see at my little mini map at the bottom, you can see that it's 
pointing this way so I'm going to head over this way now I'm at this I like to set my head in an altitude I'll just click on it should give me a good altitude and I'm going to set both of them and once I'm at this point I do set my flaps to up as you can see and we'll see you when we and you're just going to leave here until you get into Gran Canaria or wherever you're going and we'll see you there As you can see, we are getting a little bit close to the runway, so we are going to go out and we're going to go this way for a go around. If there is ATC in this server, by the way, you will need to request the landing. Now, once you're at this point, you want to turn around and you want to set your flaps to land. So you can see I'm kind of coming out at an awkward angle here, but it is what it is, and we're going to have to land. So, kind of like... The speed you should be at is 120, but I'm going a bit faster because I forgot to slow my speed down. That's my fault. I'm sorry. But, yeah. Oops, I didn't see that person. Oh, butter. <laughs> and then what you want to do is you want to, and then like that, it would be a butter. So you want to aim for... Anyway, that is my flight line, flight project, flight tutorial. Um, make sure if you did enjoy, make sure to like and subscribe because that is really appreciated. And we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.